Hey everybody, it's a Ginger Optimist, and today I'm gonna show you how to reheat food in the Instant Pot, and it'll be just like it was freshly made. Let's do it. I have two bags of pulled pork that's already cooked, and I want to heat it up. So I'm just gonna dump it right into my Instant Pot. Now I'm just going to push it down. I'm adding a total of one and a half cups of water. I've already added the first cup. Now we're gonna put the lid on. Make sure the sealing valve is on sealed. We're going to turn the Instant Pot on manual and it's already set for eight minutes, so we're gonna let it do its thing. It took 20 minutes for our Instant Pot to come to pressure, then it cooked for eight minutes and so now I'm gonna do a quick release. The silver button has dropped down, so now we're gonna open our Instant Pot. And let's have a taste test and see if it's good and hot. And if it tastes fresh. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wow. That tastes just like it came out of Sunny's Kitchen. One of the wonderful things about reheating food in your Instant Pot, let's just say that I'm not ready for this for half an hour. I could just put the lid back on and let it stay heated for, you know, half an hour or until I need it. So that's pretty amazing. That's how easy it is to reheat food in your Instant Pot and make it taste like it was just cooked that day. Thank you so much for watching The Ginger Optimist. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you'll hit that like button. And if you're not following me already, I sure hope you will. If you wanna know every time a new video comes out, hit the bell. Thanks again, my friend, and I'll see you on the next video. God bless, bye.